Hi, I'm Scott, and today we're gonna to start the renovation on this 1949 bungalow on Dad It Yourself. Hey, good morning, everyone. Welcome to the project house. I uh, just got hired to finish this house up and get it ready to get on the market. It's in really good condition overall. The current owner uh, had done a lot of work renovating paint, uh, we just had new gutters put on this week um, Too bad. I didn't get a chance to get that uh, Filmed but the guy I hired uh, <laughs> I called him and he literally came out within the hour and installed them. This is a pretty simple uh, House it's just a big rectangle. So it's just gutters down the front and gutters down the back Let me show you around and show you some of the things we got to get done in the next couple weeks to get this house ready Okay, so this is a three-bedroom house with one bathroom so here's the first bedroom and the challenge we have here is the homeowner there used to be a closet on this wall here and they expanded it out to make the bathroom bigger I'll show you that in a second but I'm gonna have to come in and build a closet right here so that's one of the projects so the second project is here in the master or the, I should say the only bathroom uh, not a fan of that vanity, but I guess it's staying. Uh, little cosmetic things in here. The big thing is we have to tile the shower. So we'll be tiling this shower with 12 by 24s to match that floor tile. So that's project number two. Uh, master bedroom here. And here's their closet in here, and I'm going to make the closet in that other bedroom look like that. And here's the third bedroom. Let me turn a light on in here. This room is eight by eight. I don't even know how you could call this a bedroom. Uh, it's connected to the master bedroom and that door leads to the kitchen. So I'm assuming it's a nursery. Um, it is considered a bedroom because it has a closet right there. But um, it could be a really nice office or a future homeowner could probably turn this into a master bathroom also. So here's the major project. This kitchen needs some help. So we're going to keep the existing cabinets. I'm just going to refresh those. Um, like I said, this house is going to be going for sale. So we're not going to put a whole lot of it. Uh, trying to decide on the, on the countertops. They're not in bad shape. They're not the greatest in the world. But I think once the cabinets are refreshed, they'll look a lot better. Definitely getting a new faucet. Uh, new lighting in here as well, as you can see. And I got to do a repair on the ceiling. I don't know if you can see that, but there's a crack all the way down. Uh, paint, new baseboards, and new tiles actually starting today. Uh, I had to take the doors off the refrigerator so I can get them out that door into the garage. Um, that's going to be quite the project. And then over here, as you can see, there's that door that goes to that bedroom. So out back, we got a couple of projects here. Uh, this whole wall needs to be completely rebuilt, both on the inside and the outside. And we're going to replace this door with a solid door, no window in it. Uh, the frame, it's hard to tell, but the frame got damaged over here. So we're going to be pulling this whole door out and replacing it and then like I said rebuilding this wall residing and then repainting all of this so another shot of that door from the inside and you can see we got a two by four holding it and the frames all broken over there yeah this whole wall needs to be replaced right there so out back uh, not much we're gonna refresh the yard clean up the lawn uh, treat it mow it and then I don't know if you could see the fence, but it went over here and then actually continued all along the side here. Uh, Whidbey Island is known for its wind storms and this whole fence was blown over. I've uh, already staked it out. We actually have to dig up the old footings where those stakes are and put new footings in. And we're gonna actually repair that piece of fence and then continue with new fencing along this side. And that's actually just a panel system that you can get at your local Home Depot. Out here in the front, um, probably going to throw some landscaping in there. And then there's a little bit of repair over here. 
Uh, I gotta caulk the siding and repaint that. I know for sure that'll come up on a home inspection. So we're gonna take care of that. Hey, so that's it for the reno house. Uh, stay tuned over the next couple of weeks. Uh, maybe I'll actually put some content out a little quicker. We're going to try to get this project done in about 14 days. Um, hey, and if you're interested in this house and you want to live in beautiful Whidbey Island, Washington, give me a call. I can get you in touch with the realtor as well. Hey, if you have any questions, comments, or suggestions, don't forget to put those down below. Speaking of comments, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. I've got some videos over here you may be interested in, and the subscribe button's right over here. Thanks for watching. Doubt it yourself.